Digitization achieved. Interoperability achieved. In standardization achieved. But clonable codes failed in delivering the promises of credibly traceable and automated supply chain. Being a brand owner, have you realized hidden cost of clonable codes? Directly impacting your top line and bottom line. Suspects often trigger futile ground investigations. Do not forget, counterfeiters also do false scans just to cause futile ground investigation before launching actual fakes. And finally, misleading authentication causes consumer disengagement and drop in genuine authentication rate. Perpetual exercise by either market investigation or packaging team continues to complement clonables with overt covert features. But there is no performance liability. Thinking about fancy and dominant overt features. Very risky, as B2C digital authentication often skipped upon face value of overts. Eventually, control is lost. Your own authorized supply chain partners start misusing clonable identities. Even ground investigators orchestrate fake seizures and brands become optionless. Legal, keep asking for ground investigation. Packaging, pushes for overt covert feature. Marketing, keep asking promotional programs. And problem continues. Whether answer lies with non-clonables, not really. Ask for truly and performing non-clonables. Is it surface agnostic? Is it scannable on standard smartphones in hand of consumers? Is it precise and ensure hard guarantee against false alarms? Does it offer offline authentication and appless scan? Is it mass producible on standard print lines without needing any instrumentation? Does it need human intervention and or additional tools? Can it be false scanned using digitally cloned version from multiple locations? Performing non-clonables equally relevant for multi-level serialization addressing geographical diversion. Track and trace information not only helps investigator, but equally helps counterfeiters and aggregation label cloning is a threat. Thinking about RFID on aggregation label, excellent for tracking, but too bad for non-clonability. Even unit-level bulk serialization data gets replicated on unofficial line and launched in applicable geography. And worst is that unofficial line products hits market earlier. Get introduced to non-clonable paradigm. Just a simple plug-in, an existing framework non-clonable artifact gets interlinked with any format of printed code. Print it for non-clonability of primary unit. Label it for automated and trackable tamper evidence of packaging. Smart solutions getting easily manipulated or complex. Can we have simplicity without compromise? Parallel authentication system that remains an unsolved issue. No worry, it gets handled by performing non-clonables. Will you still let clonables bleed your supply chain? Solution is just a print away.